Hello and welcome to the Border Low campaign for Total War Warhammer 2. This is your lovely and beautiful host, the Zuka Bob. Um, last episode, we were able to take a big fat crap on those pesky rats down south in Astalia. Um, we are getting closer and closer to the um, end of the campaign, uh, meeting those campaign objectives of getting, I think it's 600, I want to say, maybe, uh, uh, probably way off on that, um, with the uh, chivalry. Um, and, and once this uh, series does end, I will be rather sad. Um, this is the first one I ever made, and I am having a blast with it. It's making me really happy to play through this campaign, and uh, the interaction with y'all and the characters we made and stuff like that. Just a lot of fun so far. But um, I think uh, I think we pieced out with the Wood Elves, and we still have the orcs to our um, on our doorstep in the northern Gray Mountains or southern Gray Mountains. I'm not sure. Um, and we have. What else do we have? I can get in here and look. Um, oh, I guess we didn't peace out with the Wood Elves. We went back to war, apparently. And we are at war with the High Elves. I wonder if they would take a piecing. Oh, that's some the elves crazy lag there. Long memories. Let's take a look. Nope, they will not peace with us. I'm gonna think of it. Let me take a quick look here real, real fast. I wanna make sure I'm actually recording this. Um, like I said before, I did have the, <laughs> that stream of bad luck where I kept, uh, yep, I got it going, where I kept, uh, making videos and they weren't actually recording. Um, so let's see here. I do have the, I do have Teclis is upset with me for some reason. I'm not sure why Teclis would be mad at me. Just because uh, I have great power. Only a fool underestimates yeah. his adversary. Okay. Um, what about Sorry, Big Toad over here? How dare you call me insignificant? All right, uh, looks like we're at the end of a turn phase. Um, let me make sure. Oh, maybe we're not. Champion of the lady. Okay, I think yeah, he's replenishing. Um, Blessings of the lady be upon you. He is trying to draw out that army. And true knight of Bretonia. He's just chilling. All right, let's go ahead and hit an intern. And we will get moving up there. Need to raise more money, if I remember right. I. Brought in that new army, uh, Shilfroy, or Chilfroy, or however you pronounce his name. I think his army ended up costing me a lot of upkeep. If I remember right, I'm also moving up north to take on the Norskins. Okay. We have a battle here. Um... Not really a favorable battle for them. All they have is a bunch of triads. Which those triads look like they got buffed on one of those updates. Um they have a lot of heroes though. Do I think I could take on Hmm. That's a good question. I think it's worth a shot. We'll definitely give it a try. Hopefully, Bahomed Beast Slayer doesn't die. Um, we'll definitely give this a try, though. Looks like we'll be forming up in most of the 
woods uh, it's actually on the map so maybe we'll swing over to that left side that top left side and get out into the open ground um, you want to be able to see the battlefield as much as possible we don't want the wood elves to be able to hide and get the uh, perks of being hidden um, don't really have a great army I do have a lot of calf, which is nice. Um, I'm gonna have to use them effectively, though. So hopefully, hopefully, I can play pretty tough and win this one out. Those dryads should be pretty squishable, though. Oh, their reinforcements are coming in behind us. We have a lot of heroes, though, with that reinforcing army. Hmm. I think I actually want their reinforcing army to come on and not, not have to fight them um, right from the get-go. So let's go ahead. We will line up our troops here we fight for Bretonia. normally I would be gun ho and I would run right in there and take them on uh, but we're actually gonna do the smarter thing and come over this way and face them on Bretonia. our own terms Orders. I want to see what he looks like. I don't remember actually seeing him. Oh, jeez. Look at that. He has like a gigantic ma mace. Holy crap, dude. It's like a bunch of... It's like a bunch of axes glued together. <laughs> Holy moly. Imagine being on a battlefield and you see this guy coming running at you. <laughs> Man. He has some neat looking uh, heraldry and stuff though. Okay. Alright, let's go ahead and uh, start the battle. Um, let's pop these guys into that formation. Let's go ahead and move them up. Move you up as well. Um, leave you there. Go ahead, you hop over here. Go ahead. Jeez, those are some crazy arrows. Alright, so it looks like they are coming in strong. Let's see if we can single him out. Let's go ahead and maybe just hit him with a quick charge and then back, back out. direction. Let's go ahead and bring up our trebuchet as well. Um, and run through there. That's probably a poor decision. If Dirthu oh would come after me. Um, what does this do? Oh, jeez. Man, that ability. It's crazy how far that thing shoots. Alright, so here comes in Dirthu. That's good. We wanted to face him. Uh, let's go ahead and buff up uh, the Emoth guy. Boundless um, follow! Pop that onto Dirthu. Let's go ahead and... Bring up our 
troops there. Looks like our forces are being pretty much mold. That was some nice stupidity, though. Um, Quick, no! Just running Attack! forward with my calf. Now they're stuck in melee. Um, pull out of there. Maybe we can get the cycle charge in here. There we go. Hit them pretty good. Let's go ahead and push on through. Orders! Serve and obey! Protect Britonia! Come on, lad! Trap with them! Slay them! Uh, let's see if we can drop another Doom Flock in here. Um, hopefully, hit them pretty good. I'm not sure how badly we are getting destroyed by Durthu. Let's take a quick look. Looks like Durthu is going down. Um, not as quickly as I'd like to. Uh, his health is definitely going down though, so we are getting in some hits on him. Their bows are starting to really hurt me. Fortunately, I sacrificed my calf in a stupid way. That's pretty dumb of me. Really didn't play that one through the correct way. Battle Pilgrims! Uh, Kill for the lady! I am with you! Priestess of the lady! See if we can take down Dirty Turns real quick. He doesn't have that much health left. Let's go ahead and aim into this blob over here. Earthu is almost dead. With haste. Ah, good. We killed Earthu. Um, we were about to get hit, though. My lady brought me your sight. As you were, as you say. So if we can get in here and hit them. Have all these pesky heroes now to deal with those, so that's annoying. Really didn't play this. Really didn't play this out in a good way. I think they're gonna win. Looks like they are anyways. Let's see if we can buff him up and keep him fighting, but looks like this one's pretty much over. Yeah, there we go. Dropping like flies. <laughs> I think we still kept our army, but that was just such a terrible way for me to play. That was just lazy. It is still pretty early here. I'm trying to wake up. <laughs> On Saturdays, uh, my, my wife and family go to work, and um, I, I have like a small window where I can play games and stuff like that while they're away. I got a little overzealous with starting this episode <laughs> with uh, being drowsy. I might run and grab some coffee in a second here. Just a second, maybe wake myself up. So sorry about that. Uh, it didn't look that great as a starting out episode and I did lose almost everyone. Um, which is not good. To kill Durthu, but they have Daith. Hopefully, I can flee away. Yeah, it looks like I did. Looks like I got close to Paravon, so it should be okay. They're doing all this crap. Alright, there we go. Alright, um, in one sec, I'll be right back and grab some coffee.
only the Grail companions of Ord could hope to best me, yet you would try with words. Looks like uh, Clan Skyre is trying to have me peace out with them, but we're not going to let that happen. Uh, we're going to go in there. I uh, can't. What, Skaven Blight, I think, is the name of that settlement. We'll go in and take that out here in a second. I am the blood of sheep. Okay. See how badly, how badly that. that Protector of the realm, Hyas. Yeah, Pretty bad, but not awful. Um, I don't know if we can recruit anything here. Oh yeah, there are some units here we can get. Um, you want to I know I started this campaign with the idea of getting better at playing with cavalry factions um, and I know that doesn't look like I have actually been doing that yet <laughs> alright so he has the grail val um, which means he has that upkeep reduction for uh, ground Knights, Grail Guardians, and other units. Um, so let's go ahead. We'll grab some Grail Knights for this army and some Questing Knights because uh, that's all I have in this province, it looks like. Um, let's see. I would rather have the Royal Hibigriff Knights. Let's go ahead and grab three units of that. Um, and we'll get the rest I guess here in a minute or two um, let's see where is this army is re My strength and wisdom are yours. getting units it looks like to head up north looks like Nordland's almost dead uh, so that's something we don't have to worry about as much Guardian Really need some money. Um, Attack! Looks like they wounded his. Yeah, they they wounded his damsel. Which, that's annoying. Slay them. Um, could go in this turn, but I might wait. Wait for those towers to finish up. The lady we'll wills in. it. Alright, so that's them, that's them. Let's see over here. The lion. This army is ready. Um, give you... Um, give you devastating charge before I give you foe seeker. Um, so if your army is up the there, lady. you do have an army down oh, here. Think this Ryan. Wonder, did I move too far to go? Yes, I did. All right, so there's all my forces moved. Hero, not noble son of Bretonia. Okay. Oh, onwards then. The amount of heroes that guy has in his army is crazy. I think um, this guy up here could use Forward. Thomas Dragon Drain. Armor the yeah, we'll, we'll send that guy up that way um, and then let's go ahead and hit the end turn did I know I'm trying to get those paladins all the way down there let's see if we can identify some more factions um, so you can go up With ace. this way Ooh, I'm trying to find those questing Bretonians down here somewhere 
I know they're in this area. I just don't know where. Um, I think they're all the way over here, though. So there's probably nobody up here that I want to meet up with, because this is just going to be uh, Dark Elves. Um, so let's actually send you down to here. And let's go ahead and hit another enter. So I got my coffee, so let's hope that helps with my gameplay ability. <laughs> Knights of the Blazing Sun, that's cool. Very cool. Good to see them putting some diversity into their armies. Always nice when the AI puts uh, different units in instead of just the uh, spamming certain characters. <clears throat> they did besiege Parabon, which that's not good. Uh, none of my recruitment will have come through. Um, but I do have Lewin nearby. I can swing him up there pretty quickly. Um, I think he's within one turns march of getting up to Paravon. I'll have to take a look and see here. Alright. Um, looks like right here. Yep. You seek nope. He is two turns away. So we'll I bring him up here. Glory as quick as he can. Um, if they're going to come in and siege me, I wonder if I can throw this. I cannot. Can I assault units? Yes, I can. Failure. Okay. Um, let's see here. Throw that on you for now. I wonder if one of you can assault units. No, you can't because you are besieged. For Bretonia! Not looking too good on the favorable outcome, although this army isn't that great. It's just all these heroes, it's ridiculous. Um, Alright, so we'll let them come to me. If not, we'll bring uh, Lewin up there to help out. Just got a massive bump in her income, I'm not sure what I did. Put that there, that there. Um, yes? Go ahead with you. We'll get some. I will indulge you. Some battle pilgrims. Yeah, how about four battle pilgrims and then um, I'd like some flying units. Maybe just some Pegasus knights. Um, that means I can't get four though. Yeah, maybe just one unit of Pegasus Knights to track down, like, uh, fleeing armies and stuff like that. Their upkeep isn't that high. That's no, not. Yeah, we'll give them one, one unit of Pegasus Knights. So there we go. This is my heading north army. It's not as strong, um, but it'll, it'll work for against Norska, I think. Um, let's see, Albrick, you're down here one more turn, and we'll be ready for that settlement upgrade. Okay, over here, throw that in, and, um, this one's, this one's more exposed, because it's closer to the high elves, so we'll upgrade that one first, and we'll also throw in this, uh, oh, that's nice, well, Give a upkeep reduction, plus it'll give me a tradable and um, income. So that's good. My deeds are legends. All right. So I can feel the coffee flowing through my veins. It's making me 
pumped up. It's giving me, uh, you know, uh, ideas on how to actually fight battles instead of just sending a mass cavalry charge straight, straight forward, unsupported. <laughs> uh, that's bad. That's so awful. Oh, look at that guy's unit card. Um, so I'm being pulled into war with Wintertooth, that's fine. I was heading north anyways. Um, look at that unit card though, that's awesome. Draka. So that's a... That's a, um... Specific unit there. I'm not sure... Uh, what part of the lore he's from in the tabletop game, but he must be an actual playable character. Yeah, Clan Mulder. Okay. I don't really have to worry about that. Clan Mulder's all the way up here. Doubt I'll ever see it. No! Zack Smith! <laughs> He's stinking Skaven or injuring all my all my troops. Um, probably not gonna get either of these, so we'll just go on that one. Um, over here, though, I am keep getting pestered by agents, Skaven agents. Death to the enemy! Fall the lady! Now I'm down to just Albrick. Fall, Bortonia! One more turn, and I'll be ready to go in. Um,. Actually, we can upgrade this now as well, so we'll do that. I must have had a building finish. Maybe that's why I had like that humongous bump in economy. I'm not sure where that came from though. Alright, so Port of Lowe's over here. We could throw some buildings in over here. Uh, probably don't really need to build anything because there's doesn't really matter where I build anything right now. Um, so let's go ahead and throw this in here, and we'll throw that upgrade on there as well. Um, do you know who I am? Sure. Sure I do. Ava. Income from industry. Probably grab this lightning strike that never hurts, and we'll throw him onto a Pegasus, or what's some of this? Um... Hmm. Yeah, we'll, we'll throw him on to a Pegasus. Alright. Uh, let's see if I can injure some Defend of these units. Of the Assault units. Destroy the faceless. Failure. Okay. Blessings of the lady be upon you. Okay, so you ruined my recruitment that I was doing. Very well, if you insist. I do insist. I do indeed. <laughs> um, this My army has one proceed. turn. Uh, what is this unassigned skill point? This is for Shilforai. Um, it's for missile damage. What are you? No one's really maxed up that high. Um, Let's throw him onto a Pegasus as well and give him hard to hit. Uh, that'll help him out. Looks like we did finish some technology, which is melee attack and defense for battle pilgrims. Um, could get that. That'd be really handy, but I need money for that right now. Uh, we could do this. Yeah, we'll, we'll, we'll grab that. Eventually get over to... I could get over to here, I think. I could get this. That'd be handy. We'll grab that for now. Then we'll come back and get this upkeep reduction one. Uh, but we could really beef up our farms, it looks like. These are all farm upgrades. Uh, really help out our income. Ever faithful. 
So it looks like we're getting closer to taking on Skaven Blight, I think. Ooh, that's a nice army, Franz. Franzy boy. Franzy boy with the awesome stack up there. for the rightful lords of the realm, and I will hear your demands. Um, not yet. I'm heading that way, Boris, but just give me a second before I declare war. Um, I'll get war declared on them pretty soon, but just not yet. Making my way, but... The laws of chivalry demand... Yes, sir. Why are you declaring war on me? That makes no sense. You're miles and miles away, and you don't even hate me that much. Now you're stuck in a bunch of wars with other factions. That's yeah, stupid. Alright. Let's see if we can get up here and do some recruiting. Lord of Bretonia! Deadly blade. And let's grab. It shall be so. Okay, put some of them. About to grab our uh, line troops uh, globally. Um, we went for Pegasus Knights with you for some reason. Have less upkeep, but the Hippogriff Knights are a lot better. Hmm. Well, maybe if I just do like a mix of them, I can grab a little bit of both. Um, there we go. We'll grab two and two of each of those. Then uh, last three spots, we'll just grab some. Um, um, I don't even want that many. Yeah, I probably don't. Um, so for the last three spots, actually these are something completely different also. Uh, so I probably want a trebuchet. the difference between them. Not a lot. Doesn't really add anything in except for missile damage, I see. Um, so we'll just grab one of them and then three battle pilgrims uh, for this army. And down here, we can recruit. Um, uh, we can recruit the Green Knight again. Pop him into there. So I don't have both of my heroes in that army, but we'll go in and fight that battle on this turn. And over here, I should be able to make it up to there. The king stands. I'll probably run away, but. Bartonians, attack! Oh no, he was in force march. So yeah, that's cool. So we'll kill him off. Um, which gives us a little bit of income. So there goes Making my way. Faith again. He's dead again. And there goes his hero spam. Good grief. Um, with her, let's grab 
arcane conduit. And with him, um, let's see here. Let's give him more melee attack. But he has magical attack. He must have a, a weapon on or something that gives him that. And let's see. I could go with a chivalric code to finish that off. I probably will. And I think we might grab this as well. Yeah, we'll grab bigger reduction and we'll throw that in there a little bit um, and eventually we'll get up to him and finish making him more of a hero killer type unit Paladin of Britonia. None shall see me. and that is one crappy agent <laughs> um, let's see this guy got some stuff we'll give her more wind blast um, oops uh, we will swing Honor before glory. this army up this way to take on Protector Norska. Of the realm. Let's see, down here. We can Hide them down. assign skill point. This must be for one of those guys I have roaming around. Yeah. Alright, so let's go in. We'll fight this battle. It would be nice if I had my damsel she is one turn away um hmm it would be nice to have her because without her I have no magic um so yeah I might wait one more turn and then go in that's what I'll do I'll wait one more turn and then we will go in and we'll probably end the episode uh, after the next turn Um, let's see. Let's go ahead and fast forward through this. Um, looks like the dwarves confederated with Clan Angren. Looks like we can face down this guy. Um, and we'll do so. I'll probably fight it because it's not really giving me the best odds. Um, so we'll try to take this on a Wild Roots map. We haven't played one of these yet. Uh, so this will be cool to see. Look how neat this unit card is though for that um, for that mod for uh, Mixus Legendary Lords and Heroes. That's really cool. Well, that's what a lot of these guys in my army are and how all of uh, Bretonia, all the factions had a unique lord. That's from that mod. Um, so it's a pretty, pretty sweet mod to add in there. Okay, so here we are in a Wild Roots map. Battle Pilgrims! Something's Oi! wrong with the color. It's like screwing up my Archers, screwing up my uh, my camera. I'm not sure what's going on. It looks weird. I can't really maneuver that well on this map, seeing as how thin it is. Um, let's go ahead and we'll put uh, these guys together. They'll probably come to us since we have this uh, um, trebuchet. Or maybe not. Looks like nope. Alright, so let's go ahead and we'll move our forces forward. Um, right to about here. This isn't the most maneuverable map, it looks like. Let's get a look at this guy. 
So it looks like he's not really that much different looking except for... Oh, it's a woman. That's what it is. Huh. And she's like old dark wood, whereas he has like the other stuff on him. But yeah, it's a, it's a woman. Huh. Let me know if any of y'all play the uh, tabletop game, if that's like a character that's in the tabletop game. I'm guessing it is, but... Uh, I don't know a ton about the, the lore for that game. Looks like we got Lou in up on Viaquis, and we have a paladin on a Pegasus next to him. Looks like our other paladin is hoofing it. <laughs> Yo, come on. How far away is my range? Well, it's still getting there, I see. Yeah, the the screen is just like flaring out on all those bright colors. It looks really weird. See all that? All that little pigments on the screen? Alright, let's go ahead and aim for this treekin. I think I am armor piercing. Yes, armor piercing missiles. Let's go ahead and insert and see if I can hit on myself. One of them shot me into the mud! I am not worthy. <laughs> oh, way too short. Okay. So, probably up that much, I think. Nope, still short. Yeah, really gotta come up. Probably about that high. Uh, it's still gonna be short. Dang it, man. It's hard. <laughs> it's hard to fire these stupid things. Yeah, it's gonna get one. Yeah, right in the face. There we go. Now that's bringing them all forward. Um, so let's go ahead. We'll get ready for them to, to come in. Battle Pilgrims! Uh, let's go ahead. Oh. In formation. Looks like they are dropping uh, Malachis mystifying my asthma on me. Locking formation! Gotta watch out for that asthma. Yo, come on! Beware! Oh, well, they're already sniping out my. Ready? My flying course, let's go ahead and move up. Uh, it sounds like they just dropped a another magic on me. Somehow got hung up on these dryads. For the king! By the lady! With his buffs and debuffs and everything. Uh, you go back on your target. I don't know why you jumped off of it. Go ahead and ride them down. Don't let them get out of there. Uh, let's see. Priestess of the lady! That right there, kind of could have dropped the it back a little further. Or maybe not. Um, where is that lord? King Lou and I don't know where that lord went. 
was the only thing I was chasing. Okay. There he is. Come down here. Cut that down. By the lady. Looks like they're regrouping, coming in for another another Rage. smackdown. Oh, looks like they're all dead anyways. Alright, so I think this is a wild root interception, so I think they'll all be dead regardless. Uh, so let's go ahead and hit the end, end battle. Uh, because I intercepted them. So that, that played out a little bit better as you saw. Can't hit nothing with my uh, with my uh, cannon abilities, as you saw. It was hard to figure out the depth to shoot it. So that's not that we were going to go in for that siege battle, but I think I'll save that for next episode. Um, we'll go ahead and end the episode here. Um, I haven't eaten lunch yet. And it's still semi-morning. I haven't eaten breakfast yet. So I am pretty hungry. Um, even though this coffee is coursing through my veins i'm still getting kind of weak with the hunger uh, so we'll look into eating some food here at the bazooka bob household um but thank you all for watching i hope you all enjoyed it um we got some pretty good work done this episode uh, had a terrible battle followed up by uh, auto resolve and a good battle once this in turn is done, I'll just go ahead and end the episode now, and if a battle pops up, I'll start it off there for the next episode. So thank you all for watching. Uh, please leave a like, a comment, or whatever. Uh, let me know you all are out there. Thank you for being part of the channel, and have a good day, and be safe. This is Bazooka Bob signing out for now.